Today we're going to be out and about in the local area and I'm going to take you through some top footwear picks for spring. So the first shoe we're looking at today is the Flower Mountain. There's a few different variations of these and lots of different colours. Um, they're extremely comfortable shoe. They're based on a trail running shoe uh, and they also have a cork sole. So I'd personally, um, you could wear these with loads of different outfits as we're looking more, hopefully getting into some better weather. They'd look fantastic with a pair of shorts and a nice sock as well. Or you could use them to tone down maybe a little bit of a smarter outfit and put a trainer with it. Or you could wear it with a casual outfit in there tracksuit bottoms or something like that. So a lot of the Flower Mountains are quite colourful, uh, so they work well with a, a more colourful outfit. So I've got a darker denim, uh, which matches nicely with the blue, uh, and then the lighter, more pastel colours match really nicely with the pink as well. So this is the Paraboot Michael, the Whiskey, the Suede. This is definitely a model that's better for spring and summer. Um, with the Suede, you want to keep that nice and dry and, uh, and, and avoid any rains. So are definitely a more summery shoe as the weather gets better. As soon as I said that, the sun went in. <laughs> so it's a very supple, Suede, they break in really, really easily uh, and they become very comfortable. I've got a pair, they're almost like slippers now. So I prefer to wear mine with a wider trouser, I think because it's a chunkier shoe, it sits really nicely with a wider trouser. So I've got the full count 1201s on um, and then obviously with the tones here, I've kept it quite neutral, but they, they work really well with so many different styles of outfit. So here I have the Moonstar All Weather. As the name suggests, it's a fantastic shoe for every weather. It's nice and light, so if it's hot out, your feet are gonna be absolutely fine. But then obviously if you do get some sort of shower, or any sort of rain, the rubber extends right up to the ankle. So you've got plenty of water protection and a nice thick rubber sole as well. Put it with a slimmer jean, the wider jean, it would fit really nicely and drape over the top. With a slimmer jean, it could sit just on the top there with a nice turn up potentially. It also look great with a trouser or chino as well. So here I have the GH Bass Penny Loafer. This is the 90, the Larson edition, which has that thicker, chunkier sole. Uh, so it brings a kind of, I guess, more of a casual look to the classic Penny Loafer, which GH Bass is famous for inventing. This is the Oxblood color. It really works well with a light, kind of wide, flowy trouser. Or you can wear it with a tapered jean if you cuff it a little bit higher and show off a really nice sock as well. They feel fantastic on foot. They soften up really nicely and they've got a nice, comfortable sole with a foam insert as well. 